Hello, welcome to another video, and I think we're in France at Lake Maggiore, this uh, one. It's in Italy, but yeah, we're in Lake Maggiore. Um, On full, the French border. Not, not anywhere near it. It's, uh, anyway, it's a five-lap race that we've got coming up. Yeah, um, and it's, it's the a, full course. So here we go. Ready to rumble, and here we go, lights out, and away we go. Honest John on pole there, yep. and uh, looks we'll like... Be, we'll be in second, but Robbie's just snuck into the, into the lead. That's good Honest John just briefly dropped down a moment. Anton's got second, so, yeah. Right. What's happened to Richard John? Richard down there in ninth is very unusual. I wonder if that yeah, happened there. There's issues there, I, I think. Know. I think there was some, uh, yeah, ghosting out there, and it's not... Ah, oh, there's yeah. obviously some issue with the car or pedals. Or a disconnect. I don't know. Why are you slowing down? I think it was a disconnect. It was uh, a lot of. Um, well, he's down in nine so going on this Oh, side. no, there he is. He's coasting. Yeah, he's got no drive because I think he's dropped out. Yeah, he's dropped out to eight people now rather than nine. So, yeah, that was a disconnect, unfortunately. Um, okay, so, so that's good. Honest John is going to be the only McLaren runner. Right, so where is it? He's currently in third. He's currently in third with um, Craig in fourth. The little brackets VR by the, by the side of his name shows that he's running on a VR headset. And it looks way. like we've got the two folds battling at the moment in fifth and sixth there, I believe. It's a bit low right. down for Ford. I've expected them higher than that. Uh, uh, uh. I don't know. Is the car rubbish? Yes. Not really driven the Ford, so I wouldn't know. Well, you've got one there in the uh, Mustang. I think I've won the GT40, so they're running two different cars. Um, yeah, that sort of that sort of seems to imply that you, nobody knows which one's the better one of the two. So yeah, you, maybe you hedge your bets, and, hedge your uh, bets yes. and race two different cars, and hopefully one of them will get um, a good result. Unfortunately, they're both you know, down in the fifth and sixth at the moment. So and the GT40, which I expect to be on the back end of a Mustang, isn't. No. <laughs> No, we've got, we've got the Audi seem to be struggling as well. They're in 7th yeah. and 8th, the Audi yeah, that's, R8. that's not a good run for the Audis. So maybe Normally just, the Audis are 6 inches off the bump of the car in front, but not on this one. No, I reckon it just doesn't suit this track, does it, clearly? No. Yeah, it's some marvellous liveries on these cars. I mean, you look at Irish John with his uh, Union flag. It's a bit uh, on the nose, that one, isn't it? Yeah. Because these are all manufacturers from different countries, and, of course, McLaren represented Great Britain, so... Yeah. Whoever designed that livery and decided to stick the Union flag on it deserves to be shot. Yeah. And then that's why I love uh, fourth place. We've got the obviously Renault with the Italian flag. Have they been Italian uh, manufacturer? I think you'll find that they're French. Picking up on the mistake again there. As Honest John has just lost there coming out. That was just too much power uh, coming out of the corner. Oh, really? Let's take and that back and have a look and see what actually just happened. Lost there. So, what was that? A wheel on the grass? or? Uh, right, right, so let's see. Slow it down a bit and have a look. It's just on, on the, the curb. curb. I think that's just the case. And look, he's, he's gone. He's a, he's a yeah. passenger there. That, I think, is just putting the power down a bit too quickly. John does like to run without any traction control whatsoever. And we're hard and, tires. And, and unfortunately, he's got, got split up and front wheel damage yep. here on the other side. Will, that will knock his top speed down quite considerably. Knocked about 10 miles an hour off curb. Per bit that gets damaged. Yes, yes. So uh, we're using the bonnet can now, which is one we don't use much for the looks of it, which is nice for a little bit. Maybe on board. We're, we're on board, Roger. Yeah. You can see Jag in front in the uh, Mustang and the yeah, Italian yeah. Renault in front <laughs> of uh, Craig. Renault. And the fact that uh, John, with damage, is keeping up with uh, Jag shows you that the Ford's probably not the greatest car out there. Well, even even those oh, no, we are on lap two, everyone's going to flip, everyone's going to have to flip himself on lap two. Let's see if he makes yeah, a move at Bang Gee Boy. Bang Gee Boy, I love this corner. You can cut so much out of it, not get a penalty. Yeah. No, he didn't, he didn't make the move then. One of these days, Polyphony is going to do something and they're going to change that and get a penalty and just go yes. inside the line just by a smidge and it's going to catch yeah, so Mustang's many people out. pulled away there. Oh, yeah, oh, on the grass, though. There That's going to slow down. There's no sort of adhesion on the grass. Oh, look how he's closed that one. John's up. much better on the braking. Yes. Much better. Although that, that Ford is probably an absolute tent. Oh, he's going to move around the outside. Is he going to go the radio? No, no, no. He's not going to Not there, I don't think. Is he not? Is he going to go yeah. for a move on this corner? Discretion being the better part of Valor. Can he outdrag to the, down the start finish line? I don't know, it's going to be a tough because that Mustang's probably good in a straight line. But uh, McLaren's got the toe. Didn't he uh, 
hole in the air. It's going on. It's yeah, John, Jack Glenn. Glenn's offensive there. Yeah, pretty <laughs> hard to. Otherwise, John was going to be able to nip it down up on the inside with that. So, brilliant driving by Amish John here, by yeah. not uh, going in the back there. He really did a good job. Yeah. We We've gone to the final lap yeah. now, and final uh, who got in first? Robbie. Robbie cruising in the, to an uh, easy Honda. Win the Honda. Honda yeah. 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 And he looks like his teammate Anton the second. Yeah, and he's at the gap. Yes. The third on the track now. And who was third? Yes. That was Craig in the Italian Renault. There Craig. he goes. <laughs> Uh, yeah, come around and look how close on his John was and Jack. Not being it? funny, they were yeah. all close apart from the first two. I that. love the look of that Renault. It looks so much like a Vauxhall so, GX220 in the front end. Yes, it really does. Yeah. So, uh, anyway, there's that one, and we're going to go to Fuji now, I believe. And lights are out, and this is the sprint play. So, yep. false first corner going to be an issue, probably. Oh, usually is. It tightens up dramatically as we see Day Speed trying to take. Um, Oh, there's some more cases there. We need to go back and see yeah. what's gone on. Let's have a look. So, who are we on board with? Let's see. We're on board with... I don't know. Um, oh, someone. we're on board with Jack. Yeah. So, here we go. Who misses his breaking point and goes straight on and uses Robbie as a brake. And then hits and gets, Robbie again. And gets tagged <laughs> from, by uh, Neil. Um, always going to be an issue first goal. Yeah. Here. And oh, unfortunately, right. no safety car for that one because Jack is dead. Yeah, I believe so. Um, so we'll skip on a bit. So, we'll uh, so in after all that battle, you've got Anton first, uh, the Italian Renault in second. There. Uh, I think now that we're not in Lake Majora, we can stop calling it the Italian. It's, Renault but it's still got an Italian livery. It's Welsh. Uh, it's a Welsh livery. <laughs> uh, so we've got uh, Anton uh, in the Honda. We have got Neil in the Renault in second. Yep. Dave, Dave Speed is in third for forward there. That's a good one. Uh, Craig in fourth, Richard in fifth, Oli John in sixth, and the Audi again seventh. Uh, and about and Robbie's is. down in eighth in the Honda, so there's yeah. some issue there. Really. Well, Robbie did have an issue because he ended up with uh, Jag using his oh, yes. brake so first that's quarter, so that probably knocked yeah. him down. Um, but even so, I'm looking at um, Spybands. What track. sort of track is Fuji? Is it a uh, Formula One track? Is it? It used to be in 2007 and 2008. Do they not use it? No, but it's still a real track. It still yeah. exists. It's, it still exists. It's owned by Toyota, which is why I find it incredible that Hondas are. Uh, there's a track that's chosen home as, track. The, Hon as well, the Honda home track. It's the Toyota home track. Yeah, it's Suzuka. Is the Honda home yes, track. but as Lake Majora is in France, it's the Renault <laughs> home track. Um, it, it was, it was in France for the purposes of right. this uh, We've campaign. gone over now to the feature race yeah. at Fuji, so let's see. Hopefully this race will be better. Jags in 10, so hopefully he won't take anyone out this time. Oh, hurt the rest of the scene. Let's, let's see what happens have at the a look at the first corner. Yeah, we're we'll just going to put the old rattle to it. It tightens up so much. You're going from a long straight, and you just get back a yeah, little bit. Yeah, we've gone back a bit because the graphics were not, yeah. so we've got everything on there. So let's see. So you see, it's got such a long run, and effectively you've got a hairpin at the end of it. As Richard see. goes flying down the middle there. Yeah. Brilliant manoeuvre there. Good manoeuvre there, but um, I don't know whether he's going to be able to keep his uh, seventh place. Still a good manoeuvre. It's all right. I mean, Honest there. John's down in ninth from Jake. Bringing up the rear again. I think Jag was being careful yeah. not to take anyone out like he did last time. <laughs> so I think that's why. So, um, where have we got? We've got Neil in first, Anton second. So we've got a uh, Renault, Honda Renault there. Yep. And then an Audi in fourth. What's an Audi doing up there? He's going to get a I reckon so. Uh, Ford in fifth, another Honda in sixth, McLaren down in seventh. And what's that to Jag? He must still be in 10th place up there. Yeah. As Daisy goes those really much. wide there, nearly loses the back, and he's a, he's a he's passenger, off, yeah. he's gone. Is oh. this the Fuji with the chicane? Yes, it yes, is it the Fuji is long. So. And, and two we now got two Fords fighting again, again. again in ninth and 10th place. Both you, in the GT. Those McLarens are shocking around this track because they, the McLarens have got plenty of power. Yes, but look we, where they are. We were talking about the track. Let's go back to that. So. Well, I seem to remember the McLarens being pretty awful at this track. Really? Do we know why? Not being funny, because you've got the long straight. I don't think they're terrible yeah, in a straight They're not line. terrible in a straight um, line. It's just that uh, handling was around the corner. I think they just... McLarens understeer by, yeah, by default, basically. 
Well, they seem to really, really struggled at this track in particular. I think that what really hurt in the clouds is but that. The, I apologise if you can hear a cat in the background. But the the Renault was really good here. Yeah. And so was the Honda. Yeah. Um, the Audis are clearly struggling because you've got Matty that's now gone down to fifth and uh, uh, all the there in seventh. So he's struggling. Yeah, but those McLarens are not putting in a good And um, Richard's show. down in eighth. Yeah. Honest Johnny's in seventh. And Jag and Dave Speed are, are ninth yeah, and tenth. I was, was, was going to say, on the, the, the only good thing for the McLaren drivers is that Ford is worse than them. Basically, yeah. So anyway, we're on lap two. We're following Craig at the moment. The black sheep was just gone. If you, look, if you look at the track map, yeah. he's entering the chicane now. And, yeah. yeah. All the others are just going around the preceding corner. So we've got Renault, one, two at the minute, but it looks Renault like Anton's is. going for a challenge. I'm having there. a go, but um, I'm not sure if he'll do it then. But Anton does like this track. Yes. He's normally pretty good around here. Is that Walsh? No, I think that is an Italian flag. Yeah, it's, well, it's, French, it's an Italian car, it's isn't it? It's not an Italian car, it's a French it's Renault. Car. For someone only has decided to dress it up in an Italian car. Italian colours, it's got to be because it's got Nutella sponsorship on the back it's of it. That's a jewellery. Has uh, what's happened to Neil? Because Craig's now took the lead, well, he hasn't because Anton's took the lead. What has happened to Neil? Neil's dropped off. Has he had another disconnect? I don't know. I, don't know. I think he just disappeared. I think he... We're still showing 10 people running. It's a pity. Maybe he's pitted then, so this is a true effect. No, I was going to say it's. So Anton just stole it of Craig. We've got uh, so we've got a Howdy in fourth and fifth. So they've started to do. We're on lap five, so maybe we'll skip forward a bit. Um, but the uh, yeah, yeah, yeah Neil's still in it. Still yeah, in nine. So, so I reckon he pitted. He must have pitted. Um, Honest John in tenth now. Yeah, those McLarens were just yeah, awful. And the fault are still fighting in seventh and eighth. I mean, you really don't want to be fighting your team, mate, do you? Not really, really, no. If, if one is faster than the other, and, uh, and this is something that I know that the McLaren team lets do, if one was visibly faster than the, than the other, yeah. the one in front would pull to one side and right yeah, the faster one. Well, we've skipped a lap 14 now, so let's see. We've probably done last pit stops, do we think? A lot of them, it looks like it. Although so, Anton's showing a bit of tyre weight. He's got so half a tank of fuel, so... Yeah. Um, so Anton there, so he's probably already done, his done it. Neil was back to second, so that must have been after yeah. the pit stop was shaking his own down. So Neil there and in the red. Similar tyre wear and fuel consumption. And Honest so John's made it to third in that McLaren, yeah, which is an easy task. He's, I or has he he's, got a pit again? I think he's got a pit again. Those tyres are more heavily worn now. I don't think he's got the fuel to run. Robbie there has definitely got a pit again. He has yeah. fuel to go And the tyres are. Well, he's, yeah. So there's another pit stop to go here at Fuji. Um, Richard's up to six. Jag's still seventh. Um, yeah, they've been terrible here. Would you default on that stroke? Then? What's going on here? We've got Robbie and not on the drag race. Drag race. It's uh, McLaren yeah. versus. Uh, uh, I can't say honest. John has got worse tyres, but hasn't just got the power from the engine to get him past. Oh, look at it's, that. Look at that. That's that is a beautiful yeah. shot, isn't it? And they're side by side, who's going to end it? Look at that! Breaking battle for the first quarter. Into turn one. Yeah, I think Robbie's, Robbie's got the inside line, but has he overcooked it? Runs a bit wide. Oh, Robbie's chopped up the inside bit. No, he's done it. But, uh, yeah, he held on to it. It's probably more than very just the good. We've done got Jag in the pits and Richard, so that's got to be final stop. That is, is that the soft to, to, to try it faster? Yeah, with four laps, four laps to the end, they're going to be putting softs off the back, without a doubt. And we'll see when they leave. They're both putting a bit of fuel. Uh, hopefully we can see if they've put softs on. Uh, oh, no, we couldn't see. So, no, we don't know, but we assume that they were. I can imagine, with only four laps left, you've got to put the softs on, as we see. Um, no. We're right on board with Richard there, and he's still running the mediums. And so he's uh, uh, Jack. Weird, so I can only, only surmise from that that the tyre wear is absolutely horrific on the softs. Yeah. Because before laps to go, normally it's so, a no-brainer, but anyway, we're now on the last lap. Yeah, final lap now. Yeah. Neil, Neil crossing the line for a fine line. win, and look at the gap. And who's in second? Anton, Anton, just coming around the final corner now. So there's a Renault first, 
upon the second one looks a bit. Yeah. And it looks on like the third. On the third is where that Robbie in the distance yeah. and yeah. Craig the red Craig Ford. Ford. So yeah. Honda and Renault being the strong top cars at this yeah. track. Would you believe? Look at Anton's tyre wear. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty bad, isn't it? So, right, brilliant. Well, anyway, I hope you liked that one. If you enjoyed it, please hit the like. Next week, we are uh, uh, Laguna, Laguna Seca. Seca for the final, I think. Yeah. Yes, it is, round 11 and 12. So, we'll see you then. Bye.